we come in all shapes and sizes, from different backgrounds and beliefs. Whether you know exactly who you are, or you're just starting your journey, at your core, you're a human being. You exist in the world. And simply by existing, you're entitled to certain basic rights, your human rights. These are the same rights that every other human has. Your child, your neighbor, a refugee, a farmer. We all get these rights at birth, without exception. Because human rights don't have to be earned, they're yours, regardless of who you are or what you've done. They exist at three basic levels, international, constitutional, and statutory. You may have heard of the right to education, the right to food, or the right to housing. These are international human rights. They apply to every single person around the world, and they are enshrined in the Universal Declaration of Human Rights. You also have rights that are specific to Canada. These are protected by our Constitution in the Charter of Rights and Freedoms. They include the right to vote, the right to equality, and freedom of expression. These rights all dictate how governments should treat people. But there's a third level, statutory. The laws that dictate how people should treat each other in certain situations. Unless there's a justifiable reason, these laws protect you from discrimination by other people or organizations. For example, if you're looking for a washroom, there should be one you feel safe using. If you're trying to get medical help, you should be able to make it inside of the doctor's office. If you're interviewing for a job, you shouldn't be rejected because you're pregnant. And if you're looking to rent a home, you shouldn't be turned down because of your race. If you live anywhere on the lands now known as British Columbia, your rights are protected by the BC Human Rights Code. This code is a shield. It's a tool to seek help and justice. It protects you in the areas of employment, housing and services, like stores and restaurants. This means people like your landlord, your boss or your server can't discriminate against you based on certain characteristics or grounds. Things like gender expression, ability, family status, age, religion, the list goes on. The code is here to support you because you have rights. We all do. And we also have responsibilities to respect the rights of others, to recognize discrimination, to speak out against injustice, and together to preserve dignity, respect, and the beauty of the human experience. <laughs>